Thursday, May 18th, 2023. Today is officially day one of Welcome to Rockville. We technically had a day zero of Rockville yesterday, so there was a early day for people that are camping. We're tent camping here. You can check out that video. Put a link up above. The skies and weather forecast today actually seem like it might be another Welcome to Rainville type of day. We'll see how that goes. We are sporting Daytona Owners Club bands, courtesy of a contest that Danny Wimmer presents, did on Facebook for the amount of followers that their group was getting. So they gave away random upgrades. So we did buy tickets, but they give you upgraded passes, randomly selected. So we'll be able to take you guys through Owners Club and VIP to be able to show you the different levels of amenities that are available. By the way, camping theme this year, Alien Invasion. Gates are open five minutes early. I'll say this, first impressions for Owners Club, having their own entranceway, we flew right in. We're walking right behind the Space Zebra stage. See the back where the artists are walking up and down. Cool view. Owners Club gets a whole bunch of goodies, including this tented area that's overseeing the stage. Take a quick peek see what the view's like up here. Here's the view of the festival grounds and the stage from Owners Club. Now that's a pretty good view of the stage. And the big plus, all of your food and drinks included. Because of the cocktails that they have for Owners Club also. Now that is Space Zebra stage. This is the open field for everyone to see the bands field distance kind of split in half by this ferris wheel and we're heading over this way to eventually get to the merch tent vip area over here as well if you have owners club you can get into the vip section as well metallica's black and whiskey has their bar set up again right next to jack daniels coffee and food corn dog and fries 20 bucks I made it to the merch tent. This is what we're looking at like for today. It's got a Ben Sevenfold merchandise. Slipknot. Rockville generic merch. It's got Pantera merch over here also. More Pantera and Tool. Deftones. Hate Breed. Incubus. Deftones. All right, Mary's getting merch. I'm going to get some free water because it is like 30 degrees hotter in that tent for the merchandise. Now we can go wander a little bit. Merch acquired, free water acquired. It's like a big beatbox. Oh, yeah. It's the US Army sucking you in. You go in the big beatbox, you come out a green plastic army man. <laughs> Nicotine pouches next to the Copenhagen experience. And across from that is Jack Daniels and the music experience. Strung is here, the guitar string jewelry company. And here's our bracelets. Oh, the Shamrock. And the Villain 3. This is what it looks like in here. Try some guitars. The Ibanez with the F-holes. Super hot. You can get the Nina Strauss model. You can literally buy it here. PRS, Miles Kennedy, Mark Tremonte. I need this chair for my house. Kramer's got a display. I have always wanted this Richie Sambora model. It is so cool looking. Dean guitars. Funny seeing Kerry King play a Dean instead of BC Rich. Weird. Zemaitis. You say Zemaitis, I say Zemaitis. The design work on these guitars is always amazing. Look at this, no frets. Many guitars are back here too, including Eddie Van Halen. Stuff falling down off camera. Or you can win one of these guitars. You can win this dime guitar, but look at this Van Halen Monsters of Rock tour. Holy cow. It's amazing. Got these amazing dime keychains here too. Meandering through Jack Daniels. Get to the other side. The Taylor Foundation for Corey Taylor. PTSD support. 
At the Revolver booth, they have artist signings. You can meet your favorite bands. Walking back through the Midway. Artist posters up here, Pantera, Avenged, Slipknot. This is where merchandise was last year and years prior, but now it's beverages and food. And they've put a shade tent in the middle with tables to eat. That's awesome. More merch, Demons Behind Me, Fuck Cancer, Mortis, Vivinti, one of my favorite booths every year. Six shirts, it's here with Fart Cushion. Dime Bag Hardware is in the house. Dime Slime here. Holy cow. Dimes wash burn days. Dressing room sign. Uh, his beard died, dude. That is so crazy. Oh, look at that. I remember that. Paul yeah. Stanley inspired cracked glass, or cracked mirror, rather. Dime guitar. Uh, and the influence of Kiss on Dime. Autograph guitar used from Ace Freely. By the way, there is tons of merch here too. Crazy. Dean from Hill. We have the tribute guitar painted like this. There it is on the headstock. More alcohol. So I think that's the second year that Dimebag Hardware was here and with those guitars on display. It's literally like time stood still. It is so emotional or sad to see that stuff. Honors Club has an air conditioned tent here too with a bar and food. Grab and go appetizers, oh, she said chips, that. plantains, yogurt, trail mix. All right, first band to kick off. Welcome to Rock 123. It's going to be Silly Goose. Also playing at the same time as Silly Goose. Making a pit stop at Heaven Tiki. It is not sponsored by Kraken this year. This year, this year we've moved to Kenny Chesney's Alcohol. We're heading over to Oxygen Stage to see Rain City Drive, and they are showing Silly Goose and playing their music on the screen here. Thank you. 
City Drive is over. We're in the Jack Daniels town. I'm having a uh, rock and roller. It's basically like three shots of Jack, one shot of cinnamon whiskey, and a splash of Pepsi. It looks like Superman is coming. It's kind of the ultimate alien, Superman, coming his way. And we're moving again. Rock villain stage this time for Widow 7. get some lunch. A little spam fried rice before we head back in. And we've headed back in. Gonna go check out Vended, Corey Taylor's son. That is as long as these storms up here don't come into play. Seek Shelter has returned. Social media for updates. Here we go again. We're going back to the grandstands and you could either rocky it and go up the stairs or be like us and go up the escalator. There's no way I'm going up those stairs. This, it's just not happening. So, um, feel energized. Oh, hey, Connor. I'm feeling cool. <laughs> and we're moving downstairs again. Concert shirt. Concert shirt. We're moving again. Everybody's coming back in at once. No set times posted yet, so. Well, me and uh, we are not sure which stage to go to because none of the set times are up here. Updated times, no more trivium, and they are the local boys, so that's ridiculous. But instead, we'll keep Bullet for my Valentine. And Suicidal, which was one of the main reasons why we came, is playing the same time as Slipknot. The walk back to Space Zebra for Bullet for my Valentine. back into the owner's club tent to get some snacks. Trail mix. Gazpacho. Oh, what's this? Oh my goodness. Some with the small Nashville hot chicken. Oh! Nashville. Nashville hot chicken. All right, I got Nashville hot chicken. Uh, literally three nachos with some pulled pork, and I don't know what that is. It's corn nuggets. They're pretty good. 
with the adjusted schedule, Vended is playing the same time as Bullet, so we're gonna go try to check out a couple songs of Vended. So, for the last 40 minutes, I can't find anybody that I'm here with because I had split off to watch a little bit of vending. And then my phone went into SOS mode because there's so many people here, you can't get a, sig you can't get a signal at all from any carrier. This is the third Rockville in a row. There's been nothing but issues with cell towers here. And now the quest begins to find everybody that's at this stage. Like needles in a haystack. Rivals is on stage right now. This next song I wrote about how I almost gave up doing exactly this. Fighting a stage. But I did it! Woo! And getting a cell signal. This song is called Alkaline. Pussifer from a distance. <laughs> Up next on Rock Villain is Bandmade. Straight out of Japan. Now the herd heads over to see Rob Zombie. So Rob Zombie, seven minutes late to come into the stage. This guy is way partied out, coming out over here. But seven minutes late to come into the stage, and his loops stopped working halfway through. So more tracks. Oh, maybe we're back. So the screens have like error codes up on them. Not working. And we're back.
bandage is working. Thank you. <laughs> Trying to fix it, but we're wasting too much time. We wanted to present you with the best possible show, and everything got fucked. Production, am I right? What's wrong with the guys backstage? Still fucking fix it! Fucking mental, man. So, we might have to cut our shit short because we don't want to, uh. Hey, man, shit happens. I'm not here to fucking slip knock, but, uh. And now we gotta try to go see Slipknot. So Rob Zombie started late which is now causing Slipknot to start late.
left towards the end of Slipknot. I am just in so much pain. But off in the distance, crazy enough, tons of lightning happening. I guess the lightning warnings are selective. You can see it up there in the clouds. So by the way, it is a quarter after one. We are full on disco. <laughs> and everyone around us. <sighs> on that note, good night. Morning again. I'm not gonna lie, the shower's behind me. Pretty awesome. Water pressure, great. Super hot. Sunrise up ahead. Day one was just punishing walking back and forth in the stages. I ended up putting me nine miles of walking yesterday, the lightning coming back, not that great. Technical difficulties during zombie, also not that great. I escaped into the van for a minute because literally our tents are like right on top of each other and you can hear everybody snoring right next to you. Um, last comments, uh, it is very, very much more crowded this year than it has been in prior years and that was for a Thursday. The lineup was good. Then it kind of sags a little bit, and then it's good. Line up for today on Friday. Also, I think there's a couple of bands that I want to see early on, and then it kind of dips and, and comes back up again later. Um, we've been coming to Rockville for 10 years. I like the days of it being like two days, and then was three days, and it just kind of like stacked back to back. I also miss the old Rockville crowds, and I would not want to gatekeep this uh, because it's so awesome, but... Um, I would love to see some type of limit of the amount of people. When you get to the headliners, like between Rob Zombie and especially like Slipknot last night, um, you get your space, and I get it, it's a general mission show, people are going to try to weave around and everything, but to be, you know, three or four songs into things, and you kind of get these huge meathead, self-entitled bros that come in, yeah, we to get back to and we can do some business, and like literally stand right in front of you instead of just continuing moving towards the stage or anything. That kind of shit is annoying to me, and I get it. It's a general mission show, um, you know, but it just makes me want to pay for individual concerts and see, like, Rob Zombie separate and um, so we're Slipknot separate and not have to deal with the amount of people that are around because it does get uh, a little um, annoying, especially when you're with shorter people and they can't uh, see the show um, to the side. I always try to be cognizant or at least self-aware of the people that are maybe behind me so that I can move to the side and let people see. But other than that, um, the, the lineup and music, it was great to get back to Rockville for a full day again yesterday. And uh, today, back at it. Uh, Avenge Sevenfold tonight. Um, there's not supposed to be rain in the forecast today. No, it, everything kind of shifted and shifted and shifted every day. And that's the one thing to look at whenever you're scheduling to, to come to Rockville because people start panicking and see that you know it might rain. It's rained every year of this event, except for when they held it in November. And um, I think it might have even rained a little bit then. But um, in any event, getting out of here. Thanks a lot for coming along. Thank you very much for all of your likes, comments, and subscriptions. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Have a great day. See you guys.